Wake up, sleepyhead. The sun's been up for ages. Five more minutes, Mom. You're late, Blue. School? Oh, no. Uh, why didn't you wake me up before? Oh, the alarm didn't go off. Oh, no. Uh, uh, I can't believe this. Uh, hang on a sec. School's out. The alarm didn't go off because I'm on vacation. Oh, Mom, your joke is Blue. not funny. Ah, uh, but you fell for it, didn't you? <laughs> I'm sleepy. I'm going back uh, to bed. You should try to go to bed oh. earlier, you know. You were up really late last night. I was reading. Fairies, myth, or reality. Oh, don't you ever get tired of these silly things? They're not silly, okay? Uh, actually, now the school is over, you can help me in the shop. No. Good morning, sunshine. I'm not going to huh? spend my summer working in the shop. I wish I could go somewhere fun with my friends. When you're older, you can go wherever you want. How old is older? I'm already 16, Dad. Only 16. You are still my little girl. Dad, it's not fair. Listen, in a few weeks, we'll all be going to the beach like we do every year. But all my friends go on holidays by themselves. That would have been the best present ever. Well, speaking of presents, we've got a little surprise for you. Yeah, just a little something to help you get around Gardenia. Really? Thanks, Dad! Huh? Nice, huh? Uh, well, yeah, thanks. See? She doesn't know what to say. I don't know, maybe she was expecting something a bit more sophisticated? A bicycle with a speedometer, maybe. A scooter, Mike. But scooters are dangerous and they cost a bundle. We'll try to put some money aside. Maybe next year we can get her one. Oh, he'll never change. My dad will never let me ride anything faster than a bicycle. Hey, Bloom! Uh -huh. Vacationing in Gardenia this year? No, actually, we'll be going away very soon. The same old beach, huh? I'll send you a postcard from our vacation place. That'll give you a chance to see something <laughs> Hey, careful with that scooter. It's brand new, you know. Have a nice summer, Mitzi. See you at school. What a show off. Go on, Kiko, but stick around, all right? What's the matter, Kiko? Goodness, did you see that, Kiko? Uh, oh. Solar wind! <sighs> Go away, you villain, or you will feel the magic of the sun and moon fairy! <laughs> Your time's up, fairy! Good heavens! Uh, ghoulies, take the scepter! Uh, give me that scepter! Mm, not so brave now, are you? Let her go! Or else I'll... Wait, what am I going to do? Get back! Huh? Did did I just do that? Hands off, Kiko! Yes. Oh. Come here, I'll smash you like a china doll! Uh, oh no! Wow, powerful! 
all. <laughs> Are you okay? Well, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> I have my scepter back. You don't scare me anymore. <laughs> Only returning the compliment, your beast. Again, Blondie. Thank goodness they're gone at last. Uh, uh, hey, are you all right? Answer me. We'd better go home now, Kiko. This girl needs help. Nut, come forward. So, you have failed. Not my fault, Your Highness. I had the scepter in my hands, but then this earthling girl appears and messes everything up. An earthling girl? Oh, but she was not your ordinary earthling. She's got power, this girl. She pushed back my ghouls just like that. Interesting. Describe her. Mm, well, let's see. She was a... Uh, your glasses, where are they? Uh, right here, Highness. Well, put them on, you dolt! A nearsighted ogre. How ridiculous. If only he'd wear his glasses, he'd be all right. Oh, will you stop defending him? An ogre with glasses looks kind of lame. Quiet! That girl could mean something to us. Oh, but Highness, don't worry. One of my ghouls grabbed this. It's a piece of that girl's clothing. To us, this is nothing. But to a hunting troll, it's an important clue. You see? Good. Then go back to Gardenia and find the girl. Mm. And this time, don't, don't let, let us down. down. Bloom, I'm not sure I understand. Could you run that by me again? I already told you she was attacked by some horrible creatures. She's some kind of fairy. Hmm, I see. You believe me then? No, I don't. I, I think we should call the police and take this girl to a hospital. No, no, huh? please, don't tell anyone. She's coming too. How do you feel, dear? Huh? I'm all right. Thanks for helping me oh, out. Oh, it was nothing. My name is Stella. Hi, Stella. My name is Bloom. Should we call your parents, Stella? Well, that would be difficult. I come from a place that's a bit far from here. Have you heard of Solaria? It's a kingdom far, far hmm. away. I'm a fairy, you know. I was trying to get to Althea Castle in the realm of magic. So oh, I... but of course. I'm calling the police. It doesn't take a genius to realize that this girl is seriously out of her mind. Hmm. Hmm. Duh. All right, you believe me now? I saw her and I believe her. Those creatures attacked me and I was forced to land here. On your planet, your daughter saved my life. She pushed back the uh -huh. ghouls with an energy shield. Actually, I don't know how I did it. The fairy doesn't need to know how. She just does it, that's all. I'm a, a fairy? Of course you are. Don't tell me you're not. Have you registered for the new program at Althea Castle? It's the best school for young fairies like you and me. No, no. Stop talking nonsense, please. Ah, uh, here we are. Troll, do your thing. Ah. Find mm. that girl! Mm. This way! So, this is your room, huh? Wow! Did you draw these? Yes! They're amazing! Sorry, I'm a bit nosy. Oh no, it's okay, Stella. I mean, huh? no, things are not okay. For instance, I still don't understand what happened in the park. Bloom, you used your powers to save me. You should be proud of yourself. In my world, magic is a part of life, and powers such as yours are perfectly normal. Is your world like that? Hmm. Is it? Yes, almost. But it's much nicer in here. It's so different. I guess it all depends on your point of view, Stella. I still can't get over what happened. 
Strong feelings such as fear have summoned up the wonderful powers that are in you. They were always there, you just didn't know it. It's just a question of concentration. With your energy, you can do anything. Watch. Okay, now it's your turn. Give them back their original shape. Uh, well? Nothing. I can't do it. You should come with me to Alfea Castle. It's a school for fairies. A new session is about to start. You could learn to control your powers. And I'm sure you'd make an excellent fairy. Where is Althea? It's in the enchanted realm of magics. A place oh. beyond time and space where mm. everything is possible. If you want to see the school, I'll show it to you. This is a bottomless postcard. Watch this. Magic! Now follow me! She's not far. The smell is strong. There's another fairy. It's Stella. They're together. I just jump in like you? Oh! Yes, hurry up before the gate closes. I've lost the scent. She's disappeared. Huh, fairies. It's totally ridiculous. <gasps> Mike, it's not ridiculous. It's true. Come on. Admit it. You and I both know that Stella is a real fairy. But you're afraid to believe it. Mike, if this is Bloom's true nature, who are we to stop her? This is Althea Castle. Nice, huh? I'm sure you'd like it here. But what about my high school in Gardenia? I mean, everything is happening so fast. Listen, think about it. I've got to leave tomorrow morning, with or without you. All right, I'll sleep on it. Now, how do we get out of here? Easy. All you got to do is jump up. <gasps> Wait a minute. <gasps> the scent is back. They're in this house. Good work, troll. They can't escape us now. We'll go in through the back door and take the whole happy family by surprise. Huh? Ah! Ah! What's wrong, Kiko? Ah! We'll play later, okay? We're really busy right now. Ah! What? Ah! 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 Hungry again? You just had your dinner. You're gonna have to wait a bit. What is that rabbit doing? Trashing the kitchen? Kiko, come here immediately! Those girls must be around here somewhere! We're right behind you! What? Now, let's settle this! Wing slash Solaria! You dummy, you got beat by a cutesy blonde! Ordinary blonde. Bloom, we're outnumbered. We're gonna have to split them up. I have an idea. I'll take care of the ghouls. All right, Blondie. Want to see what me and the troll can do? If I were you, I'd get ready to lick my wounds. Know what I mean? Very well. Let's see what you two can do against that burning uh, sun. Now what do I do? But... <laughs> oh, wow, Stella sure knows how to command respect. Oh, oh. Stella, Bloom, don't worry. I've called the specialists. Uh, <laughs> like a racket, I can't hear a thing. <laughs> Ah! 
guys, I'm ready. Okay, let's take him to jail where he belongs. What's the rush? Don't you want to have a little bit of fun first? I wouldn't be so cocky if I were you. After all, this is only our first mission. <laughs> yeah! I rest my case. <laughs> Stay behind me. <laughs> Sky, would you mind doing something? <laughs> what? My turn. Bullseye. Yeah, well done, but it's not over yet. Girls. Huh? Okay, who wants to feel my blade, huh? See, I told you you could do it. Then I'm really a fairy. Of course you are. I'm never wrong. Rats! <sighs> 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 Finally, this one's over. <sighs> Blue, meet our four heroes. Huh? Riven, Prince Sky, hey. Timmy, <laughs> and Brandon, Prince Sky's squire. Hello. <clears throat> hey, you, where do you think you're going? <laughs> hmm? See you later! You know, it would be easy for me to straighten up everything with a little magic. Thanks, but I prefer this one. Bloom's ready. You're sure about this, sweetie? Yes, Dad. I'm going with Stella to the Realm of Magics and Althea Castle. Call us as soon as you get there and let us know everything. I still can't believe we agreed to this. What if you get sick? What if you meet these monsters again? What if- Dad, I'll be careful, I promise. Bloom, we love you very much. And please come home as soon as the session's over next summer. We'll miss you. And I'll miss you both so much. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, did you really think we'd let you go just like that? No, no, we're coming with you. Really? Wow, thanks, Dad. This is so Duh, great. Yeah, no sweat. And anyway, I really want to see this famous magic dimension you keep talking about. So... Stella, is it possible? Hmm, well, the rules don't allow it, but as they say, rules are made to be broken. Are you ready? We were born ready. To magics we go! really does exist. You believe us now? Come on, we gotta go. Classes are about to begin. This is the realm of magics. Wow. This is like nothing I've ever seen. That must be your school over there. Are you excited? You bet I am. Well, let's go then. We don't want to be... Hey, it's like there's an invisible wall. I can't get through. Really? Hmm. Where is it? I can't feel anything. Are you guys pulling my leg? No, honey. Honest. <laughs> Hmm. Stella, oh. did you do that by any chance? No, Bloom. It's a protective barrier. It keeps non-magical creatures out of Althea. Sorry. I'm afraid you can't go any further. Mom! Dad! Guess it's time to say goodbye, Bloom. Oh, my precious little girl. Always do your best, okay? And remember, we'll always be there for you, no matter what. Kiko, you keep an eye on her. <gasps> Don't 
worry. She's in good hands. Come on, we gotta go. I'll be back home for a visit as soon as I can. I'll send you home now. Ready? Stay there, don't move. Valeria! And have a nice trip! Hmm? Ready to take the plunge? Once you cross the barrier, there's no turning back. My mind's made up, Stella. I'm going with you. Whoa. All right, let's get moving. It's time to show our faces. This place is gorgeous. Uh -huh. Don't let that distract you. Who is that lady over there? Griselda, head of discipline. It's okay to let her distract you. What is your name, young lady? Uh, Eleanor of Delona. I, I sent my registration form. All right, a let's see if your name appears on the list. Eleanor, Eleanor, are you nervous, young lady? Uh, a little. I... There you are, Eleanor of Delona. You can go in. Thank you. Next. What now? I'm not on the list. Yes, you are. I think of everything. The Princess of Callista was supposed to come here this year, but she changed her mind for some reason. She gave me a letter to give to the headmistress. I just won't give it to her, that's all. Anyway, no one here knows the Princess of Callisto. And you want me to take her place? Come on, Stella, we're being dishonest here. Oh, it's just a little white lie. Come on, girl. It's too late to turn back now. Good morning, Miss Griselda. Well, if it isn't Princess Stella of Solari, I never thought I'd see you here. After what happened last year, I'm surprised you've chosen to grace us with your presence once again. I don't give it that easily, you know. Right, and who's your friend? The Princess of Callisto. The Princess of Callisto? Hmm. Ah, Veranda of Callisto. Yeah, that's me. You two may come in. See? Next! I always have great ideas. How are you doing in Minimum? By the way, Stella, what happened last year? Uh, it was nothing. Miss Griselda loves to dramatize. The new students are here. They all look so nice. Buddy, young the... fairies. Ah, oh, it's been so many centuries since I was one of them. Yet it feels like only yesterday. Uh, um, uh, professors, I, I can't see a thing. Excuse me, could you? How? Oh. <laughs> well, that ought to do the trick. Oh, that's better. Hmm? Oh. oh, Professor Whiskers, you should be a little more cautious with your transformations. This school will be your home for the next five years. But this home can cease to be yours at any moment. The rules of this institution are based on discipline. Disregard these rules and I'll personally escort you to the front gate. This is not a magician's school. You're not here to learn hocus pocus. Consequently, you may not use your powers in the hallways or other common areas. In fact, the only place where you may display your powers is in your classroom under teacher supervision. Is that clear, Princess Stella? Thanks to you and your antics, the potion laboratory will not be accessible until next month at the earliest. Now, I think you know what not to do if you wish to stay. Huh? You did that? So, my father paid for all the damages. Sorry I'm late. I hope you'll excuse me. Ladies, here comes your headmistress. Attention! Oh, really, there's no need to be so stodgy. I hope Miss Griselda hasn't frightened you too much. Welcome to Althea, the best fairy school in the whole of magics. Mind you, it's also the only one. Come on in, ladies. Here we are. And so we begin our orientation session, by the end of which we should all know each other better. Becoming a fairy is hard work, but I know that everyone here can do it. Keep in mind that the teachers and I are always here to help you. Okay, enough with the boring stuff. Feel free to explore your surroundings, but be very careful. There are dangers lurking about. Stay away from the Witches of Cloud Tower. <laughs> Listen, that's what's coming up. Stay away from the Witches of Cloud Tower. All right, speeches are over. Everyone's dismissed. You're free till dinner time. 
Good luck, everybody. I'll see you all tomorrow. Oh, and classes start at 8 o'clock sharp. Do be punctual. You'll like Headmistress Farragonda. She always says the same thing, but she's really nice. Who are the witches of Cloud Tower? Magix has three schools. Ours is one. There's the Red Fountain School of Specialists. That's where the squad guys go. Finally, there's the Witches School of Cloud Tower. Witches? Wow. Yeah, well, better steer clear of them. Hey, look! We're in the same apartment. Cool. That's my room over there. The same one I had last year. You've got a room all to yourself? Well, how lucky you. I've got a roommate. No! <gasps> no! Oh, 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 sorry. No, excuse me. I just got here and, uh, well, I left my things all over the floor. This is a talking plant. One of my creations. My name is Flora. <laughs> oh, 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 my. <sighs> Uh, my name's Bloom. Ahem, <clears throat> Bloom? Oh, I mean, yes, Bloom is a name I like a lot, but it's not my name. In fact, uh, my real name is Veranda of a Callisto. Yeah, that's it. Callisto? Fourth World of Magic Realms Upper Ring? Wow, that's quite a ways away. Hi, my name's Tecna. Hi, Tecna. I'm Stella. Hey, I've heard about you. Me too. By the way, before you blow up your room, give us time to duck and cover, okay? <laughs> <laughs> um, it was just an accident, if you really want to know. An accident that got you expelled? How did you manage to get readmitted? Well, the truth is, they couldn't do without someone as gorgeous as me. <coughs> oh, bad plan. Put him down right away. No, Flora. Don't scold your plan. Kiko probably tried to eat it. It was just trying to defend itself. Are you hungry, little bunny? Here. Oh! Speaking of food, what do you say we eat out tonight? It'll be our way of celebrating the new school year. Great idea. That'll give us a chance to get to know one another. Anyone for pizza? What's pizza? Yeah, what is it? It's the national dish of Callisto, more or less. Magic Station, last stop. Please transfer here. Are we there yet? Can I open my eyes? Yes, go ahead. Take a look. You look disappointed. Of course I'm disappointed. This is it. Magix, capital of the realm of magic, most enchanted city in the universe. Well, what did you expect? I don't know. Dragons, gnomes, wizards, shops full of magic wands. But that's fairy tale stuff. This is the real world. Here, everything lives off its own magical energy. Magic is everywhere. Whoa! Good heavens! If you want to see it, you just gotta look. And now let's eat. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> and over here we have frames with a little more attitude, shall we say. Hmm, I don't know. Serpents and salamanders. It's them! Hmm, uh, excuse me, sir. Did you see uh, yeah. what I think I saw? What's that? There was a group of girls that just walked oh, by. Yes. I'm not crazy. No, not at all. They were students from Alfia. Today is the beginning of their new school year. My glasses! Come back here! I must warn my highnesses immediately. They're in magics too. They can deal with things themselves this time. Hello? Ah, uh, Nut! What is it this time, you useless smelly ogre? The fairy and her friends are in town, my highness. I just saw them walk by. They were headed downtown. Are you sure? That sounds almost too good to be true. Stella's scepter must be ours. 
Now listen to me! You won't fail us this time, and if you do, I'll make triple sure that you'll never ever again take your glasses off! Got it? No, no glasses, please! I promise I won't fail! I don't understand why my cell's not working. See, I pressed down the number and nothing happens. Let me have a look. I'm very good with electronic stuff. <laughs> no, that's so funny. This is prehistoric technology. Where did you get that thing? But it's the most recent model. On Earth, maybe. Sorry, I shouldn't have laughed. That was rude. Hello, Bloom? Hi, Mom. Everything is great. The school is wonderful, and I'm sharing an apartment with Stella and three other girls. No, courses start tomorrow morning, but don't worry, I'll keep you posted, all right? Yes, I understand. Uh, I won't forget, I promise. Uh, Mom, I've got to go now. My friends are calling me, so a big hug and kiss Daddy for me, please. Bye. I'm sure it's him, the creature that attacked us in Gardenia. Oh, he's watching my friends. But where is he now? I must find him. Well, Nut? Uh, I saw the blonde girl with the magic scepter in the square. And, yeah, uh, she was, was with her friend. We've got to get that scepter! Hmm? Sisters, we are being watched. Hmm. May I take care of it? Move, you big oaf, I can't see a thing! <laughs> now all I have to do is disappear. <laughs> and she'll stay here. <sighs> That's better. Like our little joke? Turn around! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> oh, I am a fairy. Ha! You call that magic, hmm? I'll show you the magic. Now that's magic. <laughs> and that oh, is magic. No. <laughs> Where's Rhonda? She should be back by now. I don't know. Maybe she got lost. Get down here! I'm not done yet! <laughs> and now, the final touch. <laughs> What a pity you had to meet us. Sweet little fairy. Leave her alone. Take us on instead. Pathetic. Not? They're all yours. Have fun. Turn you animal. <laughs> She's the girl with the scepter. That experience. Sonic Blast. Golden Paw. 
Colin. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, what a blockhead. All right, you things, you asked for it. Everybody come behind me. Firewall! Sisters, leave them to me. Ah! And now, prepare for the worst. Solaria! Let's get out of here, girl. Right? It's okay, you're safe now. You know, Bloom, for an Earthling, I must admit, you did really well. You were very brave. Stella! Stella. <gasps> Is there anything we should know about Bloom of Callisto? Uh, well, I might have been fibbing a bit about Bloom's background. Uh, I'll explain everything on our way back to Althea. <laughs> Have any idea what time uh, it is? Young ladies, we were worried sick. Go to bed immediately. We'll discuss the rules again tomorrow. Uh, not so fast, Princess Veranda. Isn't there something you forgot to tell us? All right. My name is Blue and I'm from Earth. Ha, I knew it. You're not a real princess. Young lady, you have tricked us. True, but still. She must be a magical creature, or the barrier would have kept her out. Now tell me, Bloom, why didn't you give us your real name? Well, I... Ma'am, this whole thing was my idea. It's okay, Stella. I come from a small town on planet Earth called... Outside the realm of magics? Utterly impossible. I beg you, don't send me away. I've always wanted to be a fairy with all my heart, and now I can make my dream come true. Oh, uh... yeah. You lied to us, and that is unforgivable. But she also has a dream, and she totally believes in it. She has displayed a great tenacity, and isn't that a quality that every fairy should possess? Yes, ma'am. Now go to bed. And don't make any more noise. Yes, ma'am! Yes, ma <laughs> I didn't think there were any fairies left on Earth. Me neither. I thought they'd all disappeared centuries ago. Well then, who is Bloom? Who? The Winx! Us! I mean, if we're going to be a group, we should have a name. Don't you think? Um, actually, it's not a bad idea. A name is good for a quick reference. It's true! The three witches are the tricks. And we could be called something like the Super Five, uh, the Stella Five. Oh, I've got it! The Airy Fairies! The... the what? <laughs> the Airy Fairies! It's short and sweet and it rhymes. What's wrong? You don't like it, Musa? Nah, sounds terrible. I vote for Winx! Me too! Perfect! Because, you see, I've already come up with a logo. Simple yet catchy. <gasps> this looks fantastic! Yes, but, uh, what does Winx mean? Uh, nothing, just Winx! Good morning, everyone. As usual, it befalls me to kick off the school year. Now, for those of you who haven't met me yet, I am Professor Whiskers, your Ooh. teacher of metamorphosis, mm -hmm. or, as I prefer to call it, the art of changing the way, the way you, you look. look. Oh, but that's nothing. By year's end, you'll do better than that. <laughs> no! <laughs> and since every ending must have a beginning, let us start with a simple exercise. Concentrate. Look in the mirror. Look at yourself. And think about changing the color of your hair. <gasps> Don't worry, Bloom. If at first you don't succeed, try again. Let's try again, okay? 
All right. One last time and that's it. School's just beginning. If you don't get it today, it's not the end of the world. Where I come from, there's a saying. Don't put off till tomorrow what you can do today. Where I come from, we have no such expression. And we're all much more relaxed. Stella, please. Oh, all right. But remember, concentrate. Think of a color. And imagine your hair starting to change. The new color slowly spreading from the root to the tip of your hair. Great! See what I end up with? Bloom, you're not paying attention! You're not concentrating enough! Well, at least something happened, and that's <laughs> progress! <laughs> oh, stop <laughs> laughing! Why should she? Look at this! I'm ridiculous! That's not true. All you need is a bit of practice. You no, know, I've never had such a rough day. The first day is always like that. Girls, can I ask you something? Uh-huh. Why are you here at Althea? Because I want to become a real fairy. Successful, beautiful, powerful, and universally admired. Of course, I also want to do good things like making people happy and bringing back together estranged lovers, starting with my parents. I want to become a real fairy, too. But I'm here primarily because I really love to learn. Oh, that is such a nerdy answer! What about you, Bloom? Well, that's the problem. I have no idea what I'm doing here. Hey, what is this? Is this a narcissist yeah. soup or something? Yeah, yeah it's got carrots. Hmm. Mm. You can see it yourself. Oh, in the fall. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You're crazy. It's getting edible flowers. You're going to so get kicked good. good. Oh, yes, you are. About time. What took you guys so long? My fault. I overslept. Watch out for Mistress Griselda. Somehow, I don't think she's a very nice person. Young ladies, your attention, please. As is the tradition among the magic schools, the annual gala in honor of our new students will be held tonight. Students of the Alfea College for Fairies and the Red Fountain School for Magicians will gather here in our castle to perform the traditional welcome gift exchange ceremony. Oh, yes. Yes. Welcome. Yes. welcome. Silence, please. Oh, Miss Faragonda, our headmistress, is speaking. Let's show a little respect. Thank you, Griselda. One more thing I'd like to say. I am calling on all your creative minds to turn this ordinary looking hall into a festive ballroom. So today's classes are canceled. Get to work and do us proud. Attention please, here comes head witchtress Griffin. My young witches, I've summoned you here because I have a sad piece of news to share. The fairies are hosting a party tonight, and once again the witches of Cloud Tower have not been invited. Yes, my friends, I agree with you, but this is an opportunity for you to test your cursing skills. It is the duty of every witch in this school to crash this party and wipe the smile off their face. They've snubbed us, we'll make them pay. And so I urge you to come up with a way to ruin their little fiesta. Submit your proposals and I'll select one. May the worst witch win. What do you think? Should we come up with a little scheme? Why not? Oh, come on. We'd just be wasting our time. Trust me, Stormy dear. It'll be fun. Classes are canceled, and this is just our second day. What do we have to do for the party? Easy, Bloom. Just get ready to have a ball. I'll provide the decorations. And I'll take care of the music. I mean, what's a party without dancing? And I'll worry about what to wear, because clothes are important too. And of course, I refuse to go unnoticed. Well... What do you think? It's gorgeous. Mind you, it wasn't cheap, but look at it. It was calling me from the shop window. Buy me, buy me, please. And of course you answered its plea. How very noble of you. Well, I'm bound to make an impression. Uh -huh, I hear the guys from Red Fountain are really cute. Guys? As if I care about that. Then why are you dressed like an absolute diva? That's besides the point. You attend a ceremony, you dress accordingly. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm um, sorry, but do you think they'll let me in dressed like this? Oh, Bloom. You don't have a dress? No problem. There's a solution to everything, and in this case, it's called shopping. Wings, if your hand is warm in mine, it'll give us greater power. With a feeling we'll be sure to find weakness. Wings, we just might you can enchant and lighten up our world. With a feeling we can take fine watches. If you desire, you can become wings. 
How about this one? Hmm, too expensive. I'll pay for it. No, Stella, you might offend her. Now what? Well... It's getting kind of late, Bloom. Yeah, we've got to get back to Althea. You'll be all right? Don't worry, I'll find something. At least I hope so. The cheapest dress I've seen so far costs my entire weekly allowance for the next 10 years. Oh, Eureka! A sale! We lost a horrible idea. Terrible. Despicable. In other words, it's the best. Well done, you three. Great start to the year. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Professor. Now, please don't disappoint me. We'll get to work right away, ma'am. Trust us, you can be sure we won't fail. Tonight, you'll sleep with the sound of crying fairies. The party's about to begin and I still have to fix my dress. Kiko, yeah, you've got to help me. This dress is way too long. Scissors, oh, scissors, oh. scissors. Oh, I need a pair of scissors. Huh? Kiko, I don't think that'll work. Hmm. Hmm. Ta-da! It works! Hey, what's going on? Oh, Brandon, Sky, Riven, they're all here. And I'm late. Oh, what? what? Huh? Oh! oh. What a disaster! If only I had scissors! Whenever you really need something, you can never find it. Hey, this is it! What did I tell you? These tunnels have been abandoned for centuries. Back then, they connected the three schools and were used in emergencies. The entrance to Althea is straight ahead. We're almost there, then. Right. Let the fun begin! This is ridiculous. I can't even find a simple pair of scissors. I'll go check in the storeroom. Now which way do we go? Don't ask me. You're the one with the map. I recognize those voices. <gasps> hey, look. The red fountain coat of arms. The gifts must be in there. I wonder what those simpletons are going to give the fairies. Whatever they are, we'll use them to wreak havoc and spread panic. That'll give us a chance to get the ring. Come on, Darcy. Show us where it is. Go With on. pleasure, dearest sister. Illusion! Show the tricks! But... It's Stella. Great. Now we know where to find it. Come on, Stormy. Time to do your thing. At last! Oh, enchanted little eggs. How tacky. Anyway, it's time for us to prepare our own surprise. These presents shall become snake rat eggs, which will hatch at the touch of a fairy and spread terror all over. Goodness, no. Well done, sisters. Now let's get out of here. We'll hide back here so we can enjoy the show. One just Aren't like they that. great? I know. And, and did you see what happened? Oh, there they are. So, yeah, that's what, what I've decided to do. Oh, oh. Really and and I'm just so sorry. Blue, are you okay? Yes, of course. I'm so, so happy to see you here. Awesome. Yeah, me too, but I gotta go. Already? Girls, you who? You were starting to worry. What took you so long? This is an emergency. The witches are here. What are you talking about? I see Darcy and Stormy have cast a spell on the presents from Red Fountain. I heard them talk about something called a snake rat. Snake rat? Hmm. Let me consult my database. Snake rats. Swamp creatures of the Disgustabilis genies. They eat toads. Oh, thank you, Techna. We get the picture. Slimy, vicious, and venomous. Like 
the witches. But what's in it for them? Stella, let me finish. The witches want to provoke a huge panic and use it as a diversion to get their hands on your ring. Hmm, that's quite the sneaky plan. We've got to stop the eggs from being handed out. Ah, oh, too late! Look! For you, ladies. I hope you like them. Egg surprises. Yes, and the surprise is a very cuddly snake rat. We need a counterspell and fast. Come on, let's form a circle. Repeat after me. What it once was, let it be again. What it once was, let it be again. What it once was, let it be again. What it once was. This egg brings you luck. Huh? I guess I'll find out soon enough if it does or not. Let me see it. Flora, are you thinking what I'm thinking by any chance? I am indeed. And I've studied Professor Palladium's lesson very well. Huh? It's all yours, Flora. And now I'll make a little surprise blossom for our three witchy little friends. What did you do to the egg? I'll tell you later. Meanwhile, I want you to run and get changed. It's getting late. I don't believe this. The spell didn't work. All right, let's go see. Never mind, Stormy. Sooner or later, the ring will be ours. I always get what I want. Bloom, hop to it. Sorry, Tico, no time to play. Huh? <gasps> Stella's jewelry chest. Whoopsie, I've got to stop it. Hey, Ho, come back here, you! Oh, good heavens! This is very strange. <gasps> Stella's ring! It's flying away! <gasps> Hey, oh, whoa, wait for me! Where are you going? Hang on, someone's coming this way. And so is the ring! Uh, 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 gotcha! <laughs> Unbelievable. She's walking away with the ring! Nosy little missy. Why can't she mind her own business? Huh? Good. Where are the others? Poor Bloom. The witches have got her cornered. Bloom's in trouble. Young ladies, it's time to offer our gifts. Come and join the others, and you soon will play something for us. <sighs> are you ready, little girl? Your friends are not around to help you. Huh? So long, little fairy. No! I am a fairy. I must not fail. I, I will succeed. Will I'm transformed. 
Looks like we're evenly met. <laughs> That's an awfully cute little fairy outfit. Too bad you'll need more than that to win against us. Well said, little sister. Vertigo! Oh, what's going on? I'm all busy. I must offset the witch's spell. But of course! Fairies can fly, and up here, spells of illusion have no effect. <sighs> Got a problem, Darcy? Mm. Nasty little fairy. Mm. Ice prism! Ah! Frostbite! Ah! Ah! Now let's put the icing on the cake. Iceberg! <laughs> hey, we've got the ring. Let's get out of here. I did it just in time. Bloom! Bloom! Goodness, are you okay? Yes, I'm still in one piece, but where were you all? We couldn't get away from the headmistress. Is everything all right? Well, I did manage to get away from you know, them. You ran quite a risk. I know, but they have Stella's ring. I was just trying to get it back. Don't worry, Bloom. The ring is perfectly safe. What do you mean? Tell me. I've got to hurry up. A little snip here, and the finishing touch. There, ready for the party. <laughs> How do I look? Beautiful as a spring flower. You know, you never told me what you did to the egg. Simple. While you were getting dressed, I did a little magical switcheroo with the egg and the ring, which now lies in a safe place. Right, Stella? Right. I'd love to see Icy's face when she opens the shell and a swarm of beautiful butterflies comes out instead of that ring she's so desperately trying to get her paws on. Well, that's not quite how it's gonna go. Still, it'll be funny. <laughs> What is this? Well, maybe the ring's hidden inside. Something is in here, that's for sure. Hmm, I can hear a thumping sound. Ah! ah! Huh? What's that? Quack, quack, mommy! M mommy? Quack, quack, mommy! Ah! 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 mommy! Oh, I hate him! Would you, uh, like to dance? Oh, okay. <laughs> you won't run away now, will you? I won't, I promise. 